Well, another lovely day here at Easy Horse Care Rescue Centre. And here we have Oscar, who's checking out the quad. Uh, Oscar has many, many problems. As you can see, he has neurological ones where he doesn't always have control of his rear leg. It oft, he often just flings it up in the air. He, it's a neurological problem. And also, um, his suspensory system is collapsing, which if you look at all four legs, you will see that they're actually collapsing. Um, now, amazingly, this horse was used to pull a cart. Um, that's what little we do know about his history. He isn't particularly old. He's probably about 15 now. Uh, we were called out by the uh, Torrevieca Council uh, to collect him where he'd been tied up um, along a public walkway. And uh, we did. He was also absolutely skeletal at the time. Um, his owners found out where he was and came after him, would you believe, with a transit van. And they actually thought they were going to put this horse in a transit van. Uh, we called the police. Uh, the police were absolutely brilliant. They came flying round here and they very firmly told the owners that they were not allowed to take the horse back. And furthermore, I believe they also found out that their ITV had run out on the van. So, <laughs> but that's another story. Um, Oscar's been with us now for several years. Um, there will be a time when his problems will get beyond anything we can do to help him. He does have medical shoeing. Um, he's a very, very happy boy and he lives in the field here. While we can give him quality of life, he will spend the rest of his days here with us at Easy Horse Care Rescue Centre. My only comment to all this is I cannot imagine what on earth he was like pulling a cart. I mean, this horse can hardly walk straight uh, on top of the fact that he was also absolutely skeletal. Um, it was probably the movement of the, the hard work of pulling the cart, pounding on the hard ground that obviously destroyed his suspensory system. But. As we always say, we don't care what he's like. Um, we love him for what he is, and he really is a lovely, lovely boy.